Welcome back to Fabulous Ideas. And yes, in this part, I'm going to be adding the accessories over there. I'm going to be had, adding my corner unit and all of the accessories over here. I'm going to be taking the shampoos and putting them in one of the baskets. I'm going to definitely change the diffuser and yeah, um, a few more changes over here and over in the sink area. I'm definitely going to be using my new soap dispenser. So many changes, very excited. Let's get them in there. The putting in one of the baskets that I got from Amazon with just a little few um, top ups of shampoos and then I have this marble tray that um, I'm going to be putting the earbud holder and another holder that will hold something else so I'll just take my shampoos from here so it doesn't it looks all neat and then I'll put in the them into this little basket here just to neaten things up because I'm going to be putting in, and I don't know whether you saw from the previous video, the little corner unit. I'm going to hang that there in the corner and that will have all of my Mrs. Hinch little bottles. So I don't need those in that corner. They're just for like top ups. Here is my lovely soap tray that I got from Amazon. Um, and I need to get the soap dispenser changed. So here are my lovely lavenders with the sign welcome. I just love that against the white wall now. It looks so much better. It was there before, but it just looks, stands out so much better now against the white wall. I have my Pears Transparent Soap, um, which is really, really nice. And um, it smells beautiful and clean. I've had this before. I'm going to be using this soap and I think it looks nice as well. And I'm going to be putting that on that soap dish. And I think that looks really nice um, yeah nice amber color for autumn so now I'm going to be doing um, soap refills so this is my hard um, Bayless and Harding hand wash and it's really really nice and I'm going to be pulling that into the soap dispenser and then that will be what I'll be doing from now on. So I'll just be refilling them up. I mean, I like the Bayless and Harding bottles. I mean, they do look really nice. But I just think because the bathroom is the black and white theme now, I think that this soap dispenser works really well in the bathroom. And it's so very simplistic. So there we go. All filled up, ready to go in its little corner. So can't wait to see how that looks. Yes, I think that looks really nice. I do have another one um, I've showed you in a video from HomeSense. I will change it up um, as well. These little bottles here, I just love them like little decor bottles that I got from Ikea. I don't know whether they're still doing them. I've had these for years and I will never change them. I think they look really, really nice. They're all different colours um, and different lids on them, but I really, really like them. And I think they work really nice on that um, little tray there. Very delicate. So I'm keeping those. So that's lovely. So what else do I need to be putting into this bathroom? And it's really fun as well adding the accessories um, into your bathroom because it does make a big difference when you put accessories in there. There you can see in the corner by the beautiful flowers that I got from Dunnell um, is the mirror, a little hand mirror that I was showing you. And, um, you know, great for when you're applying some makeup in the bathroom. Here I have the toilet roll holder. And what I love about this toilet roll holder is that um, it does give you the option of no drilling and you get to just use the adhesive and glue and place it on the wall. So that's what we'll do now. I also like the fact that it's got this matte black and it's also got a little tray on top so you can put your phone in. It's very easy to use. It's a matter of just push it out and then um, you can easily get your toilet roll in there. So that's very easy to do. Some of them are very tricky. The one I've had once before was one that you had to unscrew um, to put your toilet roll in. So I'm happy with that. So let's get in here. You can see they do give you ex um, the parts for drilling, but I'm going to be using the glue and that's where I will be placing it in the center there. And I love the fact that I'm trying to avoid drill holes um, in the wall and this gives me that option. So let's get on with that. So let's just unscrew the glue here that they give you and 
I think that I have to leave this on for 72 hours, so therefore you cannot apply any weight on here or use it for obviously the toilet roll holder. Just allow three days to just completely let it set on that wall so that it will maintain um you know its strength on the wall because you don't want it coming off anytime soon so now that i've applied the glue i think i will find where i can fit it on the wall um and you do get a little sticker as well which you do put alongside this and you leave it on the wall with that sticker for 72 hours which does seem a long time but it's worth waiting for so be patient and wait for those 72 hours and you do get a perfect strong fit on the wall um so yeah and do not put any weight on it in that time so really not using it so yeah so that's great so i'm going to be adding the glue now and then i will put this on the wall near the toilet where I think that I want it and I do love this matte um, look and I also picked this one and I also chose this one because it does have that little um, tray on top and yeah so that little tray on top um, you can put your mobile phone on there. So I am now going to be filling my Mrs. Hinch inspired bottles up with, you know, just um, body washes, shampoos, conditioners, and also the soap bath as well. So, you know, that I'm just looking at all my ones that I buy. Um, I kind of buy them in bulk and then I'm just going to refill them up and yeah so that's what i'm going to be doing right now nothing too exciting but you know i'm going to end this video here i hope that you will come back and watch the bathroom tour and hopefully that will have all of the everything in there and i'll explain everything in that video so please join me that will either come out um tomorrow or the day after that um so i won't keep you too long with that video but I do hope that you enjoyed it. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, then please do so. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I hope that you are enjoying all of my interior designs so far because I am really enjoying making these. They're exciting me and doing a bathroom transformation has been fantastic. Don't forget to stay tuned. Hit on the notification. I have that magical door that I want to do and actually do a video on it to show you how I'm going to go about doing it. I can't wait to do that. I have some autumn um, videos to do, so stay tuned so you can see that. I'm happy that, um, you know, these videos are going so well for me lately. Stay safe. Take care.